it's so good that you're here. No, thank so, you. So good that we're talking about this. I mean, uh, the ordeal that you have been through, it's horrendous. And he made it worse for you by absconding. Yes, just everything. Absolutely. You know, you're mourning the death of, of your precious daughter and your sister, and then this happens. Yeah, I mean, it, it prolonged it. Of um, course it did. It didn't finish till um, June the 20th this year, where the, the appeal w was... Um, he didn't win the appeal. See, this is the thing, because he got sentenced to six years, didn't he? Yes. But, but, but an extra six months for putting you through hell and for absconding. Yes. And then the six months was taken away. He appealed against yeah, there's some. there was some legal reason. Oh, was it a technicality thing? Yes, there was something. So, oh, um, But we, we was at the appeal court, um, and so we did hear everything that was said. So. Oh, and the thing about it is, the thing that really struck me about it was that they had audio of your daughter saying, you're going too fast, you're going too fast. She knew that he was being reckless and you had to sit and listen to that. We had, yeah, we had to li listen to, to, to all of it. And if I could take her place in a, in a blink of an eye, I would have done. Of course she would, because you're... It shouldn't be this way around. No. It should be, shouldn't be her. She was 24. And this was the first date she'd gone on with this person. And there was just the thing that came out in the trial and that I know is something that you, this is why you're so passionate about getting the law changed was that there was no safety there and he didn't know what he was doing. No. So he was able to take out his boat numerous times, yeah. drunk, speeding, driving recklessly. If you're at the helm of something like that, and you don't know what you're doing. There, there has been, a, there was an article um, um, recently in the press where, you know, I think it's getting more and prominent where, you know, the captains, drivers of boats, yeah, yeah. whatever you like to call them, are drinking and it has come into, four more yeah. and it's getting easier to now buy purchase boats from the internet which is what he did um, and just take them out with no license no training. Can you training. imagine if people did that on the roads? Yeah. This, this doesn't make any sense does it? Just yeah. doesn't make any sense at see, all. See this is the avenue that as a family that we we want to go down yeah in fact we've joined forces with another family of another victim okay um, um, Ryan McKinley was killed the same year as Charlotte on a very similar incident mm. um, and Colin and Katrina um, the parents, parents yeah. actually, um, they, they've joined with us. Um, we've been to see um, an MP. Um, I've been seeing the same MP for, sure. for quite some, some time. Same broken showers. Yes. Yeah. So you've got support for this because yes. this is Charlotte's law that you want to bring, isn't it? We want to bring in a law yeah. of some sort. Um, Although we know it's going to be an uphill struggle. Just the laws so that it aligns with what we have on the roads. Yes. People wouldn't think about going out in their car drunk. Um, and they know there's a consequence, so there's deterrence there. Right. Whereas when there's no law, there's no deterrent, first of all, mm. and you can't hold that person accountable. It's very difficult to hold the person accountable if there is something that, that happens. So you're determined? Yeah. Absolutely uh, One determined. million percent to my last breath. I, that's, that's the only way that things will change. But I, how I, awful it, that you've had to go through what you've gone through I, in order to effect change. You know, I, I'm, I'm going to be... I've, I've emailed, written... I've actually met with quite a lot of MPs um, and um, I, I'm never, ever going to give up. I'm, it's, it, there's no way. Good, no and, and any help that, you know, anyone watching this, you know, we'd appreciate. We're at of the course. start of this now. Yeah. Um, and any help that, you know, we want to get a website going, um, anything like that, anyone, anyone there, who wants the same thing yeah. as us. There's, as a well. lot, there's, a lot, there's a lot of bereaved families yeah. out there in the same position as us. Mm. Yeah. We're not the only ones. And, and, but you're giving them a voice, which is absolutely fantastic. And, uh, and if anyone, anyone who wants to join it, uh, our voice mm. and become yeah. one, that would be as perfect. It's trying to get something if you like, positive out of the most horrendous tragedy. What else can I do? I mean, yeah. you know, what, what, what else can we do as a family? Yeah. You know, we miss Charlotte so dreadfully. Um, she is so loved by everyone. Yeah. And you you describe her in such a lovely way. I mean, what was she, what was she like? She was just so, she was so funny and loving and just... She was just the per perfect, Passionate. Yeah, perfect And person. do anything for her friends and family. And you just, life isn't the same without her, but... We need to let her legacy live on and try and make this, make a change mm. so that hopefully this won't happen or much less likely to happen yeah. if there's those laws in place. Well, I, I, all power to you. 
Absolutely, oh, Patrick. I know you're going to the Women of the Year event to, today. Yeah. Yes. Um, again, which is a really, which is a, a good thing, you know, to, to to meet up with all of these other women. Yeah. I'm sure that a lot of them will give you support as well. They definitely That'd will. That'd be great, and we'd all support each other. I think it's the only way to get through something like this, isn't yes. it? It really is. Thank you both for coming thank in. You. I really, no, I really appreciate it. No, I really I, do. thank you very much. And you've got to keep in touch with us and let us know what whatever we can do to help you.